U.S. Smokeless Tobacco Company, formerly United States Tobacco Company, manufactures smokeless tobacco products, notably dipping tobacco, but also chewing tobacco, snus, and dry snuff, and is a subsidiary of Altria. Its corporate headquarters are located in Richmond, Virginia, and it maintains factories in Clarksville and Nashville, Tennessee, Franklin Park, Illinois, and Hopkinsville, Kentucky. Copenhagen and Skoll are the company's leading brands, and each represents more than $1 billion per year in retail sales. It also sells similar products, for a lower price, under the brand names Red Seal and Husky. It also produced Rooster until 2009, when Philip Morris decided to discontinue it. The company also produces several varieties of dry snuff. Skull was one of the first moist tobacco manufacturers to offer dipping tobacco in pouches. Skull Bandits, released in 1983, were marketed in the UK in the 1980s, but the carcinogenic tobacco pouches were banned amid public protest. This product has a small amount of tobacco in a pouch with a thin outer membrane and resembles a tiny tea bag. Skull Bandits were invented by UST's marketing division, the manufacturing process was conceived by Jean Pauls of UST, and the process was automated by David Westerman of the Automation Center, Inc., Nashville, Tennessee. Since then, Skull has kept the Skull Bandits products, but has also released regular sized pouches, as well as snus, and offers pouches under the Copenhagen brand, as well. Parent company UST was purchased by Altria Group, which now includes Philip Morris USA, John Middleton Company and U.S. Smokeless Tobacco. Topic company history 1822–1870 Mason Tour 1870–1905 Wayman and Brothers 1905–1911 American Tobacco Company 1911–1922 Wayman Bruton Company 1922–2001 United States Tobacco Company 2001 Present, U.S. Smokeless Tobacco Company During the 19th century, chewing tobacco was distributed throughout the United States by George Wayman. Wayman was the inventor of Copenhagen snuff, and after his death, Wayman and Brothers was acquired by the American Tobacco Company. It is today known as the U.S. Smokeless Tobacco Company. George Wayman was the father of two sons, William and Buckworth. After their father regained control of the tobacco company in the 1860s, he gave it to his two sons, when it was named Wayman and Sons Tobacco. Following their father's death, the brothers officially adopted the name Wayman and Brothers Tobacco in the 1870s. Topic: Brands. Topic: Moist Snuff. Copenhagen Husky Red Seal Skull also produces two varieties of snus former brands include Happy Days and Rooster Topic <laughs> Chewing Tobacco WB Extra Long Cut Topic <laughs> <laughs> Dry Snuff Bruton Carhartt Devo Red Seal not to be confused with Red Seal Moist Snuff Rooster not to be confused with the former Rooster Moist Snuff Standard Wayman's Best <laughs>